Hello everyone, this is Lan Wan So. In this episode, I want to introduce you how to remote control the robotic arm by mobile phone app. For your convenience, you can scan the QR code or access the foreign URL to get the Android or iOS app and then install it in your mobile phone. Please pay more attention. Remember to open the Bluetooth before you running the robotic arm. First of all, open the mobile phone app. We can see the interface like this. There is a tools icon on the screen. When we click it, the mobile phone will search for the robotic arm. Please remember to open the switch of the robotic arm. Then the mobile phone will scan the Bluetooth of it. Then click connection. The icon changes to blue, which means connect successfully. The red button on the screen is the reset servo. We can click this button to make all servos come to the middle position. And let us move to the left side. Here, there is a setting. When you click it, you can see there is a slider here. You can drag the slider to change the action time of certain servo. Then you can see there are six sliders on the interface. Each of them can control the certain servo. We can drag each slider to move the robotic arm. It's, it's great easy, so you can have a try by yourself. Okay, let us move to here. There is a custom button. Custom button is used to set action group for the robotic arm. Because we have downloaded 10 action groups into the controller, we can use the mobile form to play with it. For example, click the button, add action. The app will prompt us to improve the name and the numbers of the robotic arm. You can define your own action group's name and improve the corresponding number in the action group number. Okay, it's time to enjoy the show. Now, let us play again with the robotic arm. It's still quite easy. So all of this is my introduction of remote controlling the robotic arm by mobile phone app. Thanks for your watching. See you.